Business Stat Chapter 16 Pre-Class Assignment Tutorial Question 2 The Linear Trend Forecasting Equation for an Annual Time Series Containing 43 Value from 1965 to 2007 on Total Revenue in Billions of Dollars is shown below. Complete Part A through E below. In Part A, we're asked to interpret the y-intercept B0, which is 3.6, and basically what that means is that 3.6 is the predicted total revenue in 1965. In part B, we're asked to interpret the slope B1, which is 1.9, and that's a positive value of, of 1.9. So what that means is that we're expecting the total revenue to increase by $1.9 billion per year. In part C, we're asked to find the fitted trend value for the fifth year. And the formula that we're going to use here is x equals to n minus 1, where n equals to 5, so we have 5 minus 1 equals to 4. And then we substitute the, the 4 into the formula of the equation. So we have y equals to 3.6 plus 1.9 times 4. So we have y equals to 11.2. So 11.2 is the expected total revenue for year 5. The reason we're using n minus 1 is because we're trying to forecast the, the year 5 total revenue based on year 4's number. In part D, we're asked to find the fitted trend value for the most recent year. So most recent year it basically is the last year, so n equals to 43. And we're going to plug that into the formula x equals to n minus 1. So we have 43 minus 1, so x equals to 42. And then we plug it into total revenue function, so y equals to 3.6 plus 1.9 times 4, 42. So our y equals to 83.4. Lastly, for part E, we're asked to find the projected trend forecast six years after the last value. So our n here is 43 plus 6, so we have n equals to 49, and our x equals to 49 minus 1, so we, we have x equals to 48, and we plug it into the total revenue functions. So we have y equals to 3.6 plus 1.9 times 48, so y equals to 94.8, and that's question 2.